What's good with your YouTube? What's good with your Fargo family? It's your boy, a long way. Fargo, y'all. No, I had to come give it to you, man. Wife say she been driving in this stuff for the first six hours. She tired of it. I said, yeah. That's what I go through at nighttime. It'll fatigue the shit out of you. But you still gotta run, still gotta get the load there. Everybody depending on this, depending on that. This is why you never let a, another man, another woman, a company drive your truck. You see all this? Now imagine if this was nighttime. See all that rooster tail, them cars throwing up in front of you, in front of us. Now how are you supposed to tell what's going on and what's not going on? Some people say safety first, but then some people say, well, uh, the load is supposed to be there at this time, huh? Well, what do you do? It's part of trucking, so before you get into truck driving, and you want to come out here and supposedly make some good money, supposedly get your, your wings and uh, drink Red Bull and Monsters and be a super trucker, you think about the days that it's nice. And you think about these days right here that old long way far ago and the wife it showed you. We 90 eastbound right here, headed to New York. There ain't nothing wrong with what we doing. We gotta click it down, back it down, take it slow. You know, I wish y'all could hear all this water on uh, coming to pop our tires and you understand why we have to back it down. We got 40,000 pounds on our back. See traffic on that side right there. You know, kind of backed up somewhat. You know, you see our rooster tail or not? Yeah, you can see it right there. You know, but this is, and our windows are not foggy. Trust that, they're not foggy. It's the highway. And a live old truck driver, man. What are you supposed to do? Y'all better think about it, man. Give y'all a little bit for a few minutes in here. I'm gonna let's go silent right quick and let y'all think about it. Is this what I really want to do? Do I want to come out here and risk the biscuit and something happen? Fatality roll over, getting backed up by the company because everybody gonna be with you when you're driving in situations like this until something happens, until something happens to that trailer until something happens to that truck and then you got the boss calling or whoever you work for even if you're working for yourself and you got yourself calling yourself y'all i'll let y'all get a little little glimpse into it like i say it's not bad man it's just that you know that's why i shut it down at nighttime you can see it's different but driving in this right here at nighttime man you think well, the highway going one way and it's going the other way and you're in the ditch got all them pinball lights around you asking what's going on on the drug test you and stuff i think we're going 55 mile an hour right now but speed limit you know so what we're supposed to do and the only reason i'm up because we ain't got a plea friend and i don't know if we're gonna get one or not so we may just say forget it go to the truck stop shut the truck down since we ain't got no pre print or no load, we might just go get us a motel. I agree. Yeah. So, we're going to start exercising all our rights. But we're going to see what's going on, man. But I think we're about to come out of it. I looked on my little weather map. It ain't too bad. Oh, yeah. I forgot. I said I'm going to give y'all a moment of silence. Come. y'all yeah, love this footage right here man about what's going on up in here see that sign that say variable speeds man you know so we coming down i think we're in ohio right babe yeah we're just on the east side of cleveland yeah so this is what we're looking at right here so but you can't uh not drive in weather all you can do is safety trumps everything i don't care who you work for 
If your boss call you and ask why that load late, you tell him to go look at the news where you at, the weather where you at, and tell them that you just call safety. Safety trumps everything. If you work for a company and they say safety don't trump everything, you need to leave that truck and that job where you found it. In the classifieds, from your homeboy, from whoever, because it ain't worth losing your life, brother. You ain't like Mario, you get another man. Nope, you don't get that. You get dead, boxed up to some nails, and some dirt, and that's it. So, it's your boy, a long way far ago. You know I'm gonna keep it raw and uncut, and I always bring it to your attention, man. Like I say, man, y'all subscribe to the channel, man. We're trying to get the channel moving, man. I got like 80% of my views on my analytics come from people that are not subscribed to me so i know you're watching out there you're watching these fargo vlogs and the wifey you know so go ahead and subscribe man you know uh it don't cost you nothing it's free man it's like this air it's free but they still charge you for it they charge you for that alkaline water too don't they y'all but man go ahead and like i say hit the bell man if you're new to the channel like comment and subscribe fargo family i appreciate y'all messing with me man you know who it is you know what it's about i'm always giving to you raw and uncut the long way y'all